This year, we also have secured funds through the uh, 2021 uh, school safety grant to add metal detectors. The walkthrough metal detectors are placed two at every middle school, two at every high school across the district. And those are predominantly to be used during large events. So if we have folks that are coming to our campus that we are not familiar with, we, we see our students every day, we see our staff every day, but when we have parents coming and visitors from other schools and other places across the state, uh, we don't know who those folks are. And so we just want to be uh, cognizant of that and, and look for ways that we can secure these, these stadiums and, and venues that we have. So the metal detectors will be used for large events. That we use, I mean, it could be football, it could be basketball, it could be for a, a large play or, or uh, some event within the school. And so uh, that is just a, a, an addition to our wanding. We always have had wands for years that we use for uh, reasonable suspicion, uh, an administrative search of students. Uh, but if, if somebody walks through this metal detector and it goes off, then we still have the ability to use those wands. I see an indicator down low showing that Brent has something in his pocket. So we can pull, they pull him aside and give him a wand. Currently now all of our high schools. Um, elementary schools have a similar system. It's the same system, but we're adding some keypads out there for them too. So right now the door will be locked. Kip would come up and punch the number in. Come in the door.